Hi everyone, in this video we have to integrate this. So there's a couple ways to do this. You can do this using use substitution or you can do it using without use substitution. Let's do it without using use substitution. So first thing you can do here is you can rewrite this. So when we have the square root of 5x, you can write that as square root of 5 times square root of x. So you can do that, right, because these are both positive, so you can combine them. It's, it's a rule. If you have the square root of a, b, that's equal to the square root of a times the square root of b. And you can do this always as long as they're both not negative. If they're both negative numbers, like a and b, uh, it's not allowed. So here, 5 is not negative numbers, so, so we can do that. So we're allowed to do that with the square roots. Then you can write it like this. You can pull out the 1 over the square root of 5. And so you're left with this piece here like this, and then you can write this as x to a power, so this is 1 over root 5, integral 1 over x to the 1 half, because the square root of x is the same thing as x to the 1 half, then you can bring it upstairs, so 1 over root 5, and you could skip a lot of these steps. Um, if I wasn't making a video, I probably would have gotten from here to, to here. You can do that, right, because you can think of this as x to the 1 half and you bring it up and, and it becomes negative. So you're allowed to skip steps. At this point, you are where you want it to be, right? You have x to a power, so, so now you can use the power rule. Let me come up here and do it. So the 1 over square root of 5 hangs out. You add 1 to this exponent here, so it becomes 1 plus negative 1 half is 1 half. So this will be x to the 1 half divided by 1 half and then plus rc. So this is almost an acceptable answer. Um, when you divide by 1 half, it's the same thing as multiplying by 2. So I'm going to put the 2 up here. So this is 2 over root 5, square root of x, going back to the square root here, plus c. And that would be a perfectly acceptable answer. So I hope this video has been helpful in some way. Take care.